it is real. Canada is not easy. You got to be ready. But I just wanted to say that, you know, you can see this video here and hear all oh, what people are saying. Thousands of people lined up for hours at this Toronto job fair. Many hopeful they'll find work after being turned down by other employers. They said, okay, we'll let you know later, or they're not looking for applicants right now. I got one interview, but then I, it got cancelled. This is we're having a tough time finding workers to fill positions. Now it's a little easier. So there's a lot of negativity out there, and I have seen online, a lot of people have been asking me questions through this front end in terms of what are the things that are there? Is this true? Is this how really bad it is when you have horrible long queues for people struggling around Calgary, around Ontario, around Mississauga, just to try to see if they can get something to do. It's true, I'm not gonna refute it. I think one of the most famous people in this country, Pierre Poulier, once said it that if you are sick in Canada, you don't have to call an ambulance, just call an Uber because there's a higher chance that the Uber driver is actually a medical doctor. But would you limit yourself to that? That's why in this series, I'm gonna bring you eight solid reasons why you wanna start a side hustle as a physician when you move to Canada or even physicians are already here, Canadian physicians, and you're looking at just increasing extra income. Without further ado, I'll dive directly into the nitty gritty of today's session. But before then, please, you want to hit like and subscribe as this will naturally help the channel. Please don't shy away. And I want you to share this video with all your friends. Medical surveys, the links is in the description. Please check it out. You can do lots of medical survey. You are a specialist, you're a trained personnel, highly trained. And a lot of people need medical advice from you, from a trained professional like yourself. So there's a lot of people who go on Facebook and they take random gibberish from people who post all sort of stuff online. There's medical surveys that you can literally do and I've left the links in the description box. You can earn money while answering questions online um, from various online surveys and organizations that are interested in your medical expertise and your opinion. Some examples of those platforms would definitely include M3 Global Research, InCrowd and SE. RMO group. So if you can look into those, that will definitely go a long way to give you extra income. You can get started. You just need to sign up, make sure you put your information online there, fill the forms that are on your website, and there you go. It can bring you about $300 every month. And you can use this as passive income to buy groceries for your family, for instance, or pay your electricity bill. Number two, you can do telemedicine. Telemedicine is something that's really, really taking its heights right now, especially with the events of AI becoming really, really phenomenal with people living in remote areas and doctors not having to go there to provide healthcare. Telemedicine is really important and you can do it in a physician assistant um, position. And so you can provide consultations to patients who need medical advice or care using platforms such as Teledoc, Maple, and Dialog. These are all platforms that exist and you can serve and help patients using these platforms while making you extra income. I know people, IMGs, I know doctors and physicians who are literally taking this as a full-time position. They can travel, they can be somewhere in Bali, Thailand or anywhere, but then they are providing care to their patients remotely, which is really important. And so you can do this. And I've seen people make six, seven figures just doing this um, telemedicine. And this can help you expand your research, save time and money and increase your income. To get started, you need to register with these platforms, make sure you have the right information there, verify your credentials and set your availability. Once you're available, you'll get a call and you can start as soon as possible. You can then receive requests from patients and conduct video or phone consultations. Another thing you can do is web courses and online webinars. This is becoming really current. Like you're a doctor, you've been trained for several years, you have the knowledge. Why do you only think you have to be on a bedside to help patients? Come on, you wanna go online and share the information that you have, share your knowledge. Knowledge is power. Jim Crick is always reciting and referencing. Knowledge is not just power, but knowledge is your superpower. So you can create a small online course and webinars on topics that are related to med medical specialty that you're versed with, with your grown family physician, with your particular interest. I'm pretty, pretty sure there is specific things that we really like when we're back in medical school. You can create a course on that. 
and a lot of people would buy your course. It's gonna take some time to scale, but once you start scaling, you are good for good. There's many physicians online that are doing this. I can leave some examples in the description box and you can see. You can use platforms such as Teachable, such as Zoom, such as Udemy. These are all platforms where you could use to prepare either your webinars or your courses and send them online. And this can help you share your knowledge, build your reputation, and generate passive income. To get started, you need to choose a specific topic, create a curriculum, promote your, your course and webinars to earn money. I'm pretty sure that all of you watching this right now, you have definitely taken a course on Udemy, a Google course, a Coursera course, all of these different courses are recorded and put there by people and you can literally do that. Promote the courses on different platforms and you can start making money. Blogging and YouTube. In another video, I'm gonna tell you why I started this YouTube channel and how I started it and the impact that this is creating in the life of other physicians, just like myself talking to you right now and several couple of thousand physicians around the world. I had the experience, I have been in several places and I met different people and that's where I was able to share things like meeting Nobel Prize laureate here and other very important personality in the health field, you can then share your knowledge. You can start a blog or a YouTube channel where you can post content about health and wellness topics such as tips, reviews, answering frequently asked questions. These are all the things that we can do to educate your audience, grow your following, and monetize your content. If you have not subscribed and you really want to support us more to give you information that's helpful for you, please hit subscribe and turn on the notification bell and share this to your friends. Thank you so much for doing that. Some examples of successful medical blogging and YouTubers are like the famous Dr. Mike. To get started, you need to choose a niche, create a website if you want, or create a YouTube or an Instagram page, whatever you seem convenient. Do a little bit of shorts, 16 minutes, whatever, just, just be relaxed and free. I know not everyone likes to take a camera and show their face. You can do a faceless YouTube channel. Just put your knowledge out there. I bet you there is someone out there who's looking for that information that you have. Rather than looking at these long queues of people looking for jobs and being scared and being worried, and I think you do it. In one of our videos, we're gonna talk about how I made my first 100K just within a year when I moved to Canada and the things that I did to get that and how I continue to achieve certain successes. And this is all out of clinical practice, like without me being in the clinic, without me practicing medicine as a clinician in Canada. So the next one is speaking and engagement workshops. You can be a part of a speaking and engagement workshop. You're a medical doctor trained, highly qualified, so you should be able to give lectures in specific locations to specific audience and that will be very helpful to them. So you can offer your services as a speaker or as a workshop facilitator for events and organizations that are looking for medical expertise and influencers. These can help you showcase your skills, network with other physicians and other stakeholders around your community, professional or within your space, and charge a fee for your time and your expertise. I have been able to take part in two of such where I actually charged for my services and it was really, really cool to just spend an hour and then you're able to get a paycheck that can help you to, you know, get a car repair, pump gas into your car for a month. Some examples of platforms that can help you um, find speaking and workshop opportunities will be SpeakHop, eSpeakers, and Expert Files. I've left the links in the description, please, you want to check it out. To get started, you need to create a profile, upload your portfolio and apply for gigs that match your criteria. That's really as simple as that. Social media influencer, that's if you like social media and you want to be a part of it, there's so many people nowadays who are on social media, so you as a doctor, you can be able to go there and de-inform people of all this information which is wrong and it's online. So you can leverage your social media presence to become an influencer in the medical fields by posting engaging and informative content, interacting with your followers, showing them what is actually true and correct, and making sure that you identify all of the misinformation that is ongoing online. This can help you build your personal brand, reach a wider audience, and become really famous. Partners that could probably help you propel your stuff up will be Aspiral, IQ, Famebeat. These are all platforms that can help you to connect you, to make sure you reach a greater audience. 
To get started, you need to choose a platform, grow your following, and pitch yourself to the potential sponsors. If they like you, you're good. Product and supplementation endorsement. So you can become someone who, if you have a specific law for a specific product that you use, you can endorse it. There's nothing bad in that. This can help to provide value, increase your creativity, and generate passive income. Some examples of platforms that can help you endorse product and supplementations are Fullscreen, Amazon Associates, Share sales. Choose a product or a supplement you want to promote and share the links or quotes with your referrers or within different platforms that you're at. And when somebody uses it or purchase it, then you get a commission. That's really as easy as that. These things do not take time. They are very easy. The time you spend on YouTube doing and watching TikTok or people doing fun, just, just look at one video that can teach you one of these skill sets. And then, you know, within three, five months, I'm telling you, your story is going to change. You find yourself doing stuff that you couldn't even imagine you could do. You can create and run your own online supplement and dispensary where you can sell high quality supplements to your patients, clients, or audience and earn profit. There's lots of people with online boutiques now right there. There's Shopify, there is Pinterest, there's all these different platforms where you can create a visual shop and people can purchase from this Audible. There's a lot of ways to make income online. Please don't shy away. Please don't say it's hard. Just give it a try. It's okay if you fail the first time, but you're not gonna fail in all of them. Give yourself a month or two per trying. Make sure you learn, make sure you put in your very best while you pursue your dreams of becoming a physician and getting into the healthcare system. So some of the platforms that can help you create your own dispensaries will be Full Script, Well Evade, Power Well. To get started, you need to just sign up with these platforms, customize your dispensary, choose a supplement you wanna offer, and invite customers to start shopping from you. So there you go, you get it. Please like, share this video, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.